Hello, Central Pennsylvania. Tim Rogers, the real estate coach with Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate GSA Realty. In our last video, we talked about the national market and the trends and what's going on nationally. But really, all markets are local, right? And in my opinion, all markets are hyper local. And I'm going to prove it to you in the next couple of minutes. We're going to look at the local market, the Central Pennsylvania market, and we're going to compare it to the state college market. So the Central Pennsylvania market encompasses about a dozen high schools surrounding Center County. It goes up to the mountaintop. It, it, it's Bald Eagle, Belfry. You know the area, right? But, but we're going to look at it in context of State College because there are two different markets here. And, and so let's just jump right into the numbers. And, and these are provided by CCAR, our local association. And this is we're com comparing everything year over year, January 2023 to January 2022. And the first thing that you need to know is in State College School District, closed sales are down 40% year over year. But what about the central Pennsylvania market? They're only down 28% year over year. Listings are down 47% in the state college market. In the greater central PA market, they're actually flat. They're actually up two listings year over year. So you have the central PA market with state college in the middle. You have two different markets. You need to know these numbers. But pending sales in state college, they're down 62%. Locally in central Pennsylvania, they're only down 10%. And here's here's the real kicker. We'll talk about it for a minute. So so the average sale price in the State College School District is over five hundred and twenty thousand dollars in January twenty twenty three. In the greater central PA market, it's half of that. It's two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in January twenty twenty three. So so when you talk about buyer demand and you overlay interest rates and supply and demand and and some of you watch my videos, you've seen the discussion in the last week, you understand what's going on. But the average home buyer, the largest block of home buyers in America and here is age 30 to 33. It's 25 to 34, but the biggest number is 30 to 33, right? Are they able to afford $520,000 houses? Some may be, most don't. Can they afford 250? They probably can. So now you need local market expertise in those areas of Bald Eagle, Belfont, Pence Valley, and other areas that can help those people, right? Um, new construction is still, still high. It's over $600,000 in the central PA area. I'm not going to talk about that. That's a function of the economy, too. Uh, it's a whole separate discussion. Uh, in terms of total revenue year over year, it's down 30%, right? So the total, you number the total sales in January, that revenue number is down 30%. And what is that? That's a correcting market, right? So the real estate market, if you're a sailor, right, we're, we're, we're in stormy weather, right? The seas are pitching and the boat is rocking and we're looking for some nice flat sea to sail on. And, and we're not there yet. And, and so the fact the total dollars, that's a big number. List of sales. So if you have a house and you're selling it at 200000 right now you're getting about 97% of that. You're getting $194,000. That's trending down towards 95% of list price. So again, that's the correcting market. Uh, we, we have average days on market is 63. Put that in context of last summer, right? When we had mar houses come on the market and they'd sold in one day, in two days, in three days, with five offers, six offers. I was part of a deal that had 23 offers. It hasn't completely gone away. Last week, I had a buyer lose a property on a multiple offer situation. So they're still out there. Again, the market is trying to figure out what it's going to do. But but our real estate market is local, right? You have the national numbers from before. This is a local real estate market. And in my opinion, it's hyper local, right? So you have State College, that's one market. And then you have the surrounding areas of completely different markets. So you need market experts. At Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate, GSA Realty, we have you covered. We have an office in State College. We have an office in Altoona. We have knowledge and expertise, and we have a great group of people that have expertise. They have the hyper market knowledge to help you. If you need to sell and you need to understand the market or you need to buy and you need to figure out how to get a buy down or how to get a great negotiator, you need to call us at, at GSA Realty. You need to go to our website. You need to instant message us. Get in touch with us. We're here to help you. We'll navigate those murky waters. We'll get your house sold quickly. We'll help you buy a house. We're here to help. Reach out. Give us a call. Have a great week.